What is going on? This is Altona, and I just received my new Radio Master TX16S, which is an upgrade from my previous radio. And I'll explain to you why this is an upgrade in just a second. So, just wanted to share with you what comes in the box with it and everything. Of course, you get this nice little panel of stickers, which I think are fantastic. And anybody who flies drones or <laughs> FPV or whatever, love the stickers. You have your quick start guide that's outside of the box. And then inside of the box that it comes in, you also get this container or box that will house your radio. So let's open this guy up. And there it is, in black, the Radio Master TX16S Mark II. And this one has Express LRS built in. And that's why it is an upgrade from my previous radio, because my previous radio had a 4-in-1 module built into it. But it's okay, because if you have aircraft that use different protocols, you can put a module in the back, and I'll show you that in just a second. So as you open it up here, you pull it out of the box carefully, because <laughs> it's in there very snugly, but you know that it's, it's very well protected for shipping purposes, so you don't have to worry about it getting damaged in shipping. So underneath here, this particular one actually came with um, the grips for the back, so we have the raised grips, and then we have regular grips. The raised grips are already installed. You have all of your switches. Everything looks great. These hall gimbals feel fantastic. And I love the fact that you can actually upgrade your stick ends if you want to. It is a touch screen. In here is a nice little key ring. You have your USB-C charging cable and some springs for your sticks so that you can replace them if you need to as well as an Allen wrench. And what that will allow you to do, you can actually adjust the tension on your sticks um, if you decide that you want to. There's a bunch of things that you can, you can actually adjust on here. So all of your sticks and whatnot on the top here. So you've got a USB-C connection and a DSC right there on the top. One of these will allow you to actually connect to a simulator so that you can use this controller to fly, which is again, same thing I've been doing with this one. I don't currently have batteries in it, so I'm not gonna start it up. I just got it and I just wanted to share with you what comes in the box and what it looks like. On the back here, you have your expansion base so you can put a uh, crossfire um, uh, four in one module again this one has express lrs in it built in but you can also put a express lrs external module on here as well if you want to use it to connect to other radios and, and do you know like uh, um, a student and and all that kind of stuff you have a headset jack on the back here and if you open up the battery compartment and you can, and I did, get a Radio Master battery as well for it, but you can use the battery tray in order to power your radio. On the bottom of the radio, you have another opening here, and you have a bunch of connectors. You have some connectors on either side here. There's some, there's some functions here that I'm gonna have to get used to because they were not a part of my previous radio. And then you have a charging, USB-C charging port here, and then your SD card slot that has in it, has a SD card uh, installed. You want to keep that SD card in because much of your radio software is actually located uh, on that SD card. So not only are you gonna wanna make sure you keep your SD card in here when you turn it on, but you're also gonna wanna make sure that um, uh, you back up your SD card in case something crazy goes on with the software on the SD card in the future. So there it is, that's the Radio Master TX16S. Love this radio. Like I said, I've tried a different version, very similar to this radio in the past before, and I absolutely love it. I'm excited about the upgrade to Express LRS, and I will be using this to fly all of my models, including helicopters and some of my uh, FPV drones in the future. So hope this has been helpful for you, and so you get an opportunity to really see it up front, up close and somewhat personal. <laughs> Thanks so much for stopping by and checking it out with me. And I look forward to sharing more on this with you in the future. Take care.